Oh, whilst I'm at it, I know some of y'all might be seeing me riding around in this nice kind of fresh looking nice Lexus, white Lexus. That's actually the car my mummy drives. That's actually daddy's car. Y'all know I'm a Superman fan. I believe in Superman, the man with the powers from above. If it ain't clear, I just ride that dress because it's just available. I don't buy Lexus. I don't be, I ain't a Lex fan. Lex Luthor. No, that ain't, that ain't, that ain't the one to be like. If y'all watch the movies, and I guess it can correlate to what it actually really means. Who they actually means. The savior, the one who saves. Uh, you move around like a regular man. Uh, according to the movie, only those who he saves knows that they've been saved. And sometimes they don't even know who they've been saved by. Point remains, I like Ford. I like their trucks, but I don't like that Cobra Mustang because I ain't a snake loving idol. You know how they feel about snakes. If y'all watch Conan, the WHO, I already said, got the two snakes wrapped around the sword, which represents to me the word of God. If you read the Bible, they said the word of God comes out like a sharp two-edged sword coming out of Jesus' mouth. So y'all know how I feel about the Cobras. Shelby Colbert's now that I'm a little more aware. Yeah, I still like how Mustangs look, but I ain't gonna get no Cobra. Not gonna promote no Ram vehicles, no Dodge vehicles. Nothing like that. I'm trying to get my old lady now to stop actually driving. She used to drive Mercedes. Had a couple of Hondas. Mercedes used to have the little piece kind of looking insignia on the front, which I thought was actually cool. Everybody knows who the Prince of Peace was. And you could think about the peace pipe. The chief always smoking the peace pipe to represent peace between people. Uh, you all know who it was that did away with the peace pipe, though, huh? Made it illegal. Now there's war. War all over the place <laughs> with everybody. So guess what? It is said peace would be taken away from the earth. But if you think about what it actually meant, who it actually meant, and how it actually happened, and how it happened, it'll start to make sense once you start to connect the dots. If you're smart, even the dumb ones figured it out. Oh well. We could only tell you. He was the Prince of Pete. Now they're talking about the wrath of the Lamb. Y'all on the wrong side of that wrath. When y'all feel it, y'all think it's bad to go against some flicking regular dude in the streets. Y'all actually decided to go against God's son, who has his power when needed and expected to... Huh? What? What'd they expect? These bitches already killed them motherfucking selves, injecting their own staff <laughs> with these vaccines. Now you can look at them and see. They ain't real no more. <laughs> they just not. Look around. They know it too. But when you make up your mind to try and go against God, you up here and say your hand's too short to box with God. You made up your mind to go against God and go against Jesus. The first thing you did was kill your motherfucking self. That bullet hit right here. For those who didn't know. And I'm still here telling the story. Only two other people here when it happened. And I wasn't holding no gun. So whatever story y'all heard. <laughs> it don't really matter now. Y'all know who is who and what is what. Enjoy your decisions. <laughs>